Hi guys, my name's Luke Turner and this is my journey to running 100 kilometers. Why did I decide to take on this crazy challenge? Well, back in January, I decided to run a marathon with a day's notice, just fancied the challenge. And then a friend of mine, Brad, kindly challenged me to do 100 kilometers. He said, listen, anybody can do a marathon, but not anybody can do 100 kilometers. So five months later, um, many, many kilometers down, we're now a month away from officially race day. Why did I decide to take on this challenge? Well, if you know me, then you know I'm always looking to challenge myself, taking myself outside my comfort zone. I never like to stay within that comfort zone. So something like running, where it's not uh, my strong point, I thought, you know what, let's give it a go. Let's embrace it and let's see what we can do over a six month period. Um, uh, not only that, obviously, they're doing it for an amazing cause, raising money for Crisis, which is a homelessness charity. Um, that's also a big part and something that's very motivating to me to be able to do something where there's an incentive they are raising as much money as possible for a fantastic charity. Um, so yeah, that's why I'm, I'm running this 100k run. Challenges I've faced. Um, one, let me think about it, open up uh, a new gym in between. So January we started the training program and obviously we opened T2 Fit 2.0 in May. So having a new business that we've launched is, has been challenging and trying to commit to the training regime and what days we're running, three days of intense training. It might not sound like much, but when you're going out for six hours on a Sunday, yeah, then, then you get to know about it. But do you know what? Um, there is always gonna be challenges when following any kind of crazy journey, but um, I can honestly say it's been something that's kept me on my straight and narrow, give me a purpose, give me something to do on a Sunday, especially training half of this program over lockdown. It's been good not only for um, my body, but also for my mind, so yeah.